Danny, we'll start at the end. You're safe, sending Leicester through to the quarter final. Yeah, uh, always nice to say we're in the shootout. I've uh, got a pretty decent record, but um, you know, you've got to be confident in them situations. I said to the boys before the, the shootout, you do your job and then I'll, I'll try and save them. Is it something you worked on in the week? Were you aware of the Brighton players, where they might put them, or was it a bit not, of guesswork? Not personally, but normally in the lead-up to Cup games, you know, the boys will practice penalties the day before. So yesterday, the boys will do the circles and then take it individually, go and take some penalties. But I prefer to just take a back seat and you know, go on instinct, more, more or less. It, it's a competition that's been really good for you and for Leicester in recent years. And again, the, the, the third or fourth time I think we've got through on a penalty, as you say. And you, you played a key part in a number of those games. Yeah, like I say, in them shoot, in them scenarios for goalkeepers, it's it's all everything to gain. You know, you no one really expects someone to to save a Premier League footballer's shot from 12 yards out. You know, the, the odds are in their favour. You now to come out again and on the right side of it is is brilliant for us. Personally, for you, obviously behind Casper in terms of the Premier League games, but you, every time you get a chance in these cup games, you, you seize that opportunity. You must be pleased with the performance tonight. Yeah, yeah. Ultimately, we wanted to get through, uh, regardless of how we played. We know we can. The performance can be better, especially second half with the ball. But in these cup competitions, you know, no one looks at possession stats; they just look at who's in the next round. Particularly second half, Brighton started coming on stronger. Is that how you saw the game kind of panning out? Yeah, it's difficult, you know, to get rhythm as well. A lot of boys haven't had as many minutes as they probably would have liked this year. So fitness-wise, it would have been tough towards the end. Lots of changes, lots of stops in the game. So, yeah, always difficult. But uh, like I say, happy to get through, and, uh, and we'll see who we, we face next in the quarter-final. Big night tonight for the academy. Um, four, or five players from the academy starting tonight. How do you think the young lads got on tonight in amongst the experienced pros? Really well. I mean, we say it's a cup competition, but they're playing against a Premier League team and a team that proven everyone a lot, you know, to be a real tough team this year. You know, we saw them, we saw it earlier on in the season down uh, down in Brighton away, you know, tough game, really good team, a good squad. So for them, it's an invaluable sort of experience. Vonte again, come in the same as he did last year in the same sort of fixture and he was brilliant again. You know, it's, it's brilliant experience for him and uh, hopefully that can help his development and uh, and you can only help Leicester, really, can't it?